terms of visual fidelity well they were one of the best they are one of the best games you can't like, really put forza games. horizon against um uh Terrific. no the the regular forza i forget the yeah forza, forza four. yes because one's yes! open world yeah there you go oh, bobby dude. Dude. no way it appears that the dimensions are collapsing on one another if we cannot get to get to right the ship i mean we can't be that far i have it in my sight they have found us oh my god i'm so stoked now i don't even care if they don't show any horizon zero go dawn <laughs> shit but it's just fucking <laughs> it's 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 my childhood oh here we go gameplay nice oh that was oh. so that looks so satisfying. Holy oh, crap! Oh, this is them playing with the load times. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, oh shit. Like yeah, it's just loading completely different levels. Really fast. That's awesome. You can see the load happening too. Yeah, but I mean it's super fast. It's still fast, but you can see it, which is yeah. really cool. Wow. Oh my god. Clank looks all chrome and shit. Like, he actually looks metallic. It's so good. Ratchet. We are too late. <laughs> Ratchet? Who are you? Who? Rift apart? Oh my god. Oh man, I'm so down oh, wow. for Lady Ratchet. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hi, I'm Marcus Smith, creative director at Insomniac <laughs> Games. The entire studio is so excited to be able to share so, with you a first ever look at Ratchet's first and party. Rift Apart. I mean, a brand new yeah. full length interdimensional adventure built from the ground up for the PlayStation 5. We're doing things we've never been able to do before. Like, use dimensional to say rifts before, to be able to yeah. leap from planet to planet nearly instantly, or put ray trace reflections on Clank. There All of go. our alien worlds are filled with density and life yep, previously unseen. I'm like a second Plus, behind Ratchet's you guys. All new arsenal is more exciting than I ever. I think I'm like a couple seconds ahead of you guys. Enhanced feedback. Ratchet and Clank are near and dear to our hearts at Insomniac, and we can't wait to share more with you in the future. But for now, here's another look. Is this my? What the fuck is that? Oh. That's so cool! Whoa! Reminds me of um, Bioshock when um, what's her face could like pull things in from other reality. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Elizabeth. Yeah, I think so. I like how I got just got sucked in there. It's really great seeing some of the lighting and real-time reflections happening in like an arcade game like this too. Yeah. yeah, totally. Well, this is also the type of stuff that just looks good for years yeah. too, you know? Right. It kind of, it's timeless. But you're seeing like more articles on screen. Yeah. Yeah. I think your gun's spitting out little bullet casings, which is awesome. Yeah. What is that? <laughs> what is that? What's that? Oh, damn! Oh, 
so I don't think he's making the portals appear. I think those are just appearing dynamically in the environment. Yeah, and he's just affecting them. Yeah. It like, might be a gadget that he that he has, and um, no, because I think I think the portals are just like opening randomly. Like you have the purple ones and the yellow ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, they're probably like scripted in like it's scripted. It's like the locations. yellow ones you can jump through, and the purple ones are just like enemy spawns or whatever. But still, very cool. Absolutely, yeah, I'm so stoked. stoked about that. Uh, yeah, a lot of people are probably gonna be very excited for that. Dude, that's my childhood right there. Yeah. The return of Ratchet and Clank. Yeah, that yeah, was the next super one. Stoked. That was them just like showing off with the the uh, the load times thing. Like, well, oh yeah, totally. Quite a bit going on here. Yeah, we had uh, you had RTX happening. You got to see the load times working. Like, yeah, probably at the fastest they possibly could be. Yeah. Um, at the same time, you're loading in big environments. Like they were only there for like a little bit, but if you took yeah. the second look these environments that you're jumping they through were these... large yeah huge. i mean uh, it, it's again it's some of it some of it could be you know pre-rendered backdrops or something right but I'm sure oh true. man i don't know a lot that's you're getting really close to a lot of that and a lot of that's in three dimensions but like this like come on yeah huge. yeah yeah it's a lot of open space but still um yeah no this this looked cool this looked really cool yeah, and you can almost see as you're jumping through the portals the load happening it's like a, a millisecond or two yeah but that's like the amount of time it would have taken us to load oh, you know we would have had like to sit on the screen for um, two minutes to do any of this stuff so oh sure yeah um yeah i'm saying that load time the amount of time they spent loading there for us was like when you're doing one of those crawling through a nook segments yeah. in another game you know like, yeah i just mean basically load... we just loaded through a whole game of ratchet and clank through in that one instance <laughs> like, yeah yeah um, amazing really cool really cool also they, the female made protagonist the point about... awesome oh yeah yeah totally cool i'm curious i'm super curious about her i just noticed yeah, her um, like bionic arm too oh i just did not notice that female protagonist in a lot of these trailers mm -hmm. a lot of these games coming out uh, Clank. Uh, they, they make a point to note to they they point out the ray tracing with the reflections of uh, on mm -hmm. Clank, which yeah. I appreciated too. And there was also like parts where like you know, there's just a lot of particle effects and stuff happening as well. A lot of debris yeah. on the ground. Mm -hmm. um, I'm <laughs> sorry.